Oh, wow. Wow. Will Smith just smacked the shit out of me. Did you know that Keanu Reeves once went out of his way to make a fan's day by buying an item he didn't even need just to sign an autograph? During filming for the third Bill and Ted movie, he saw a fan sign that read, You're breathtaking. Keanu didn't hesitate to jump out of his car, kneel down, and leave his autograph on the sign. It's heartwarming to see such kindness from a movie star. However, not all celebrities are as nice off-screen as they appear on it. Some have gained quite the reputation for being downright unpleasant in person. Despite their charming personas on screen, meeting them in real life might not be such a pleasant experience. As the saying goes, never meet your idol in person. In this video, we'll uncover 20 celebrities who may dazzle on screen, but turn out to be quite the opposite when the cameras stop rolling. Oh, why you playing yourself in your face with the mountains? Ah, you're safe, you're Number one, Kirstie Alley. Kirstie Alley, often presenting herself as amiable in interviews, reveals a different side through her actions. When a close friend left Scientology, she publicly criticized and bashed them on Twitter, engaging in a feud that hardly showcases her in a positive light. Her derogatory comments, including a tweet proclaiming, Haha, I love talking smack, display a troubling tendency toward hostility, seemingly outweighing the importance she places on friendships. Ali's behavior hasn't gone unnoticed, leading many other celebrities to be hesitant to collaborate with her, a decision that seems warranted. Among her most concerning actions are controversial statements linking psychiatric drugs to shooters and a tweet posted after Stephen Hawking's passing, featuring a picture of him with the caption, You had a good go at it, thanks for the input. Such conduct tarnishes her reputation, and it's unfortunate that despite not being the worst actor in the world, she has essentially marginalized herself in the industry. Number two, Jared Leto. Jared Leto, known for his portrayal of the Joker in DC films, might have a legion of devoted fans and close friendships in Hollywood, but his reputation took a hit due to some seriously eyebrow-raising behavior. Picture this. He decided it would be a grand idea to send sexual toys and used condoms as gifts to his fellow actors on set. Yes, you read that right. It's as if he was channeling the Joker's chaotic energy into his off-screen antics. But wait there's more. Additionally, Jared Leto alienates his fans with his bad behavior, often lashing out and displaying hostility. Furthermore, there are claims from other fans regarding Leto's treatment of women, alleging that he uses them before callously discarding them. One Reddit thread delved into various stories, including accusations of Leto having a particular interest in underage girls. While these remain unsubstantiated allegations, there are still numerous concerning actions attributed to Leto that leave many shaking their heads. Number 3. Kiefer Sutherland Kiefer Sutherland, renowned for his portrayal of Jack Bauer, unfortunately harbors some troubling issues. Alongside a DUI and reports of drunken misbehavior, his conduct has soured relations with other stars who have worked alongside him. Freddie Prince Jr., for instance, openly criticized Sutherland's professionalism, revealing that he hated every moment of their collaboration. While clashes between major actors are not uncommon, the extent of the discord between Sutherland and his co-stars seems to transcend typical off-camera drama. Freddie's remarks shed light on Sutherland's behavior while filming together, painting a picture of consistent unprofessionalism. Freddie's candid assertion, that's not me talking trash, I'd say it to his face, I think everyone that's worked with him has said that, underscores the seriousness of the issue. Such behavior had a profound impact on Freddie, prompting him to consider leaving the industry altogether. Despite the possibility of differing perspectives, the consensus regarding Sutherland's behavior seems clear. It reflects poorly on him, regardless of how one looks at the situation. 4. Tommy Lee Jones Tommy Lee Jones, the veteran actor known for his gruff and no-nonsense persona on screen, isn't just playing a character. 
That's simply who he is in real life. Tommy Lee Jones isn't just playing the role of a grumpy guy. He truly embodies it, rarely seen signing autographs or engaging with journalists. He's earned a reputation for cutting interviews short and walking out, leaving journalists disheartened. In one notorious incident during an interview with GQ magazine, he even made a reporter cry while casually cracking whole walnuts with his bare hands. His blunt nature doesn't discriminate. Even fellow actors like Jim Carrey have felt the sting of his harsh words. On the set of Batman Forever, Jones famously told Carrey, I hate you, I really don't like you, I cannot sanction your buffoonery. While his critique may have been too harsh, it's hard to deny the comedic value in such a memorable dismissal. I cannot sanction your buffoonery is perhaps one of the most amusing ways to tell someone to fuck off. Number 5. Terence Howard Terence Howard, known for his role as James Rhodes in Marvel's Iron Man and often perceived as a good guy on the surface, has a history marred by troubling behavior. In 2001, he faced accusations of assaulting his first wife, Laurie McComas, purportedly because she spoke to him in what he deemed a strong manner. The pattern repeated in 2005 when he allegedly punched his second wife, Michelle Ghent. Perhaps the most alarming incident occurred in 2010 when Ghent claimed Howard threw her across a hotel room and threatened to toss her over the balcony railing. Howard's confrontational attitude isn't confined to his personal life. It spills over into his professional endeavors as well. This became evident during his tenure in the Iron Man franchise, where reports suggest he was released from the role, leading to Don Cheadle's casting. Howard's departure was reportedly prompted by his demand for higher compensation, which was not met. Despite this setback, Howard continued to express grievances over the situation for years, even pointing fingers at Robert Downey Jr., who advocated for equal pay for all Avengers cast members. Next at number six is Christian Bale. Christian Bale has cultivated a reputation for being notoriously difficult to work with, often making headlines due to his high-maintenance tantrums and on-set outbursts. One particularly notable incident occurred during the filming of Terminator Salvation, where leaked audio captured Bale's explosive tirade, drawing more attention than the movie itself. In the leaked audio, Bale can be heard aggressively berating director of photography Shane Hurlbut over a ruined take, showcasing his insistence on perfection and his intolerance for mistakes. This behavior has led many to characterize him as a bully, as he appears uncompromising in his demands and unyielding in his pursuit of excellence. Moreover, Bale's reputation for being challenging to collaborate with may have influenced decisions in other projects, such as the absence of an official Robin character in the Batman trilogy. While his dedication to his craft is commendable, his approach to working with others seems to have created tension and overshadowed his professional achievements in the eyes of many. Number seven, Edward Norton. Edward Norton has garnered a reputation for being extremely rude, with rumors suggesting this played a role in Marvel's decision not to have him reprise his role as the Hulk in the Avengers. According to Kevin Feige, the president of Marvel Studios, Norton was deemed not a team player, and the studio sought an actor willing to collaborate seamlessly with a star-studded cast. Despite the immense financial success of Marvel movies, there seems to be a limit to how much bad behavior the studio is willing to tolerate. While it's true that these films can attract audiences regardless of who stars in them, there are boundaries even for those chasing the big bucks. In his statement, Feige went out of his way to clarify that Norton's departure was not due to monetary concerns, but rather his demeanor on set. One can only imagine the level of embarrassment Norton may have experienced as a result of such public criticism. 8. Tom Cruise while Tom Cruise continues to enjoy widespread popularity among many fans, his actions in Hollywood have left some scratching their heads. 
Despite his enduring appeal, it's increasingly difficult to understand why admiration for him persists. Cruz's relationship with Katie Holmes, for instance, was marked by a series of unusual rules and restrictions that extended beyond the confines of their marriage. Holmes reportedly faced limitations on her interactions with other men following their separation, restrictions on traveling with their daughter, and even constraints on communication with Cruz's ex-wife, Nicole Kidman. Such stringent controls paint a concerning picture of Cruz's behavior and raise questions about his maturity and stability. In addition to his personal life, Cruz's vocal support for Scientology has drawn criticism and alienated many. His fervent promotion of the religion with its unconventional beliefs, including those involving space aliens, can be off-putting for those who prefer not to be subjected to proselytization. Furthermore, reports of Cruz's behavior on set have further fueled speculation about his demeanor. Instances where he allegedly imposed strict rules on Navy sailors during the filming of Top Gun 2, going as far as forbidding them from engaging with him, only add to the perception of him as an eccentric and unpredictable figure. While Cruz undeniably retains a loyal fan base, his actions both on and off screen have cast a shadow over his once untarnished reputation, leaving many to question the rationale behind his continued adoration. At number nine, Jennifer Lawrence. Jennifer Lawrence's status as one of Hollywood's biggest stars doesn't necessarily correlate with a reputation for niceness, a common observation in the entertainment industry. Despite her widespread acclaim, Lawrence has faced criticism for her interactions with fans, openly admitting to occasionally being less than friendly and attributing it to a form of self-defense. While it's understandable that constant attention can be overwhelming, there's a delicate balance between setting boundaries and appearing entitled. This pattern of behavior isn't confined to fan encounters, but extends to her interactions with the press as well. In a notable incident during a 2016 press conference, Lawrence reportedly confronted a reporter for glancing at his phone. While it's plausible that she was experiencing a challenging moment, the nature of being in the public eye often necessitates maintaining composure even in difficult circumstances. Navigating fame and public scrutiny undoubtedly presents its challenges, but for those in the limelight, it's essential to cultivate a demeanor that reflects professionalism and respect, even amid personal struggles. As one of Hollywood's leading figures, Lawrence's actions are subject to heightened scrutiny, underscoring the importance of handling interactions with both fans and the media with grace and tact. 10. Tobey Maguire Tobey Maguire, while recognized for his acting talents, has garnered a reputation for his questionable treatment of others. One incident that stands out involved Maguire refusing to tip a cocktail waitress and instead requesting that she bark like a seal who wants a fish for $1,000. This bizarre and demeaning request sheds light on the darker side of Hollywood culture. Described by a casting director as the worst little monster you've ever met, Maguire's behavior off camera has left many disillusioned. Reports from sets suggest that he exhibits diva-like behavior, including forbidding others from making eye contact with him, a common trope among certain actors. More uniquely, he has been known to request that people address him by the peculiar monikers of Tugboat Maguire or Tugboat Toby, adding another layer of eccentricity to his persona. Such anecdotes paint a troubling picture of Maguire's conduct both on and off set, serving as a reminder that the glitz and glamour of Hollywood can often mask a less savoury reality. 11. Bruce Willis Bruce Willis, despite his stature in Hollywood, has found himself estranged from many of his former colleagues, with several opting not to work with him anymore. While the reasons for this remained shrouded in mystery for some time, Filmmaker Kevin Smith broke the silence, describing his experience of working with Willis as soul-crushing. 
Such candid remarks from a peer shed light on the challenging dynamics behind the scenes. Smith elaborated further, expressing the difficulty of navigating a situation where one component, presumably referring to Willis, did not align with the rest. This lack of synergy suggests that playing well with others may not be one of Willis's strong suits in the realm of acting. In addition to interpersonal challenges, Willis's refusal to participate in promotional activities such as sitting for promotional photos for their film's poster further exacerbated tensions. Such actions raise questions about the actor's commitment to collaborative efforts and the promotion of his work, both essential components in the film industry. Coming up at number 12, Mel Gibson, once regarded as a beloved figure in Hollywood, Mel Gibson's downfall has been both rapid and profound, illustrating the stark reality that even superstardom cannot shield individuals from the repercussions of their reprehensible actions. The tipping point came in 2006 when Gibson was arrested for a DUI, during which he made anti-Semitic remarks that sparked widespread outrage and condemnation, tarnishing his previously sterling reputation. However, Gibson's descent into controversy and disgrace did not halt there. He has faced continued scrutiny for his flagrant sexism, as evidenced by a revealing 1995 interview that shed light on his troubling attitudes towards women. Even noted personalities like Stephen Colbert have remarked upon Gibson's striking lack of apologies for his behavior, underscoring a concerning pattern of behavior that has persisted over time. In 2010, Gibson's misdeeds escalated to criminal proportions when he made threatening phone calls to his ex-wife, musician Oksana Grigorieva. This egregious behavior resulted in a domestic violence restraining order being issued against him, further cementing his fall from grace in the public eye. Gibson's precipitous decline serves as a stark reminder of the inherent pitfalls of unchecked fame and the undeniable repercussions of abhorrent behavior. Despite his once admired status, his actions have rightfully earned him widespread scorn and condemnation, leaving an indelible stain on his legacy in both the eyes of the public and the entertainment industry. 13. Johnny Depp Johnny Depp's reputation for violence has become increasingly concerning, with numerous accounts surfacing of altercations on set. One particularly troubling incident occurred during the filming of City of Lies, where Depp was sued for allegedly assaulting the location manager not once, but twice. It raises questions about what could possibly provoke such behavior from the actor. In addition to physical altercations, Depp has a history of destructive behavior offset as well. In 1994, he infamously destroyed a hotel room and attempted to attribute the damages to an armadillo, resulting in a hefty $10,000 bill for repairs. Furthermore, reports from ex-managers suggest that Depp's professionalism has waned over time with claims that he feels entitled to disregard learning his lines, an essential aspect of an actor's craft. While some attribute this lax attitude to his extensive collaboration with Tim Burton, who reportedly grants him considerable creative freedom, it does not excuse neglecting his responsibilities to other directors who invest significant effort in their projects. At 14, Ben Stiller. Ben Stiller, known for his comedic brilliance on the silver screen, has unfortunately garnered a reputation for less than pleasant behavior off camera. It's a perplexing phenomenon that some of the funniest individuals can also exhibit the meanest tendencies. Reports suggest that Stiller's behavior reflects a sense of entitlement often associated with superstar actors born into Hollywood dynasties. One anecdote recounts Stiller's purported freakout over the precise number of ice cubes in his Diet Coke. Why exactly two? Well, such tantrums seldom adhere to logic. 
Moreover, Stiller reportedly employs peculiar tactics to assert his dominance, such as making his private assistant stand in his parking spot to prevent others from using it. One would expect someone of his stature to have a more efficient system in place. Allegations of Stiller's unpleasant demeanor extend to his interactions with colleagues on set. A Reddit user who worked on the set of Tropic Thunder described Stiller as horrible to everyone, citing an incident where he allegedly fired an employee over the perceived inadequacy of sugar in his coffee. Evidently, Stiller is particularly meticulous about his beverages. These accounts paint a troubling picture of Stiller's behavior, underscoring the importance of humility and professionalism, even in the often chaotic world of Hollywood. 15. Julia Roberts Julia Roberts, the actress often revered as America's sweetheart, faces a contentious re-evaluation of her public image as reports surface suggesting a less than endearing persona behind the scenes. While her on-screen charisma has captivated audiences worldwide, accounts of her behavior on set paint a different picture. One notable incident involved acclaimed director Steven Spielberg expressing reluctance to collaborate with Roberts again following their work together on Hook, citing her alleged emotional volatility during filming. Such revelations have led to the crew dubbing her Tinker Hell, a stark departure from the beloved image she portrays on screen. The ramifications of Roberts's behavior extend beyond the professional realm, as her own sister has voiced grievances about the toll Roberts's ego and fame have taken on their relationship, hinting at a darker side to the actress's personality. These revelations challenge the notion of Roberts as America's sweetheart and suggest a more complex and potentially troubled individual behind the facade of stardom. Moreover, allegations of discord with co-stars have further tarnished Roberts' reputation, notably during the production of I Love Trouble, where her reported animosity towards co-star Nick Nolte necessitated scenes to be filmed separately using stand-ins. Such clashes highlight the challenges of maintaining professionalism and collaborative spirit in the competitive world of Hollywood. Number 16. Kristen Stewart. Kristen Stewart often finds herself in the crosshairs of criticism due to her association with the Twilight series, but her detractors may be overlooking more significant issues. While her portrayal of Bella Swan may not be universally acclaimed, it's essential to remember that acting is a profession and Stewart was simply doing her job, albeit in a highly visible franchise. However, beyond the glitz and glamour of the silver screen, Stewart's conduct off-camera has raised concerns. Numerous reports have surfaced describing her demeanor as consistently sulky and abrasive, creating an atmosphere that may be challenging for those around her. Such persistent negativity can undoubtedly strain relationships and hinder collaborative efforts on set. Furthermore, Stewart's personal life has been subject to public scrutiny, particularly regarding her romantic entanglements. Her highly publicized affair with the director of the Twilight films while in a relationship with co-star Robert Pattinson undoubtedly caused waves, both on and off set, leading to uncomfortable situations and strained dynamics among the cast and crew. While her talent as an actress cannot be denied, it serves as a stark reminder that success in Hollywood does not exempt individuals from accountability for their actions. 17. Sandra Bullock Sandra Bullock's public image as America's sweetheart isn't as squeaky clean as it seems. Sandra Bullock, known for her endearing on-screen persona, has had moments where her off-camera demeanor didn't quite match up to the public image she cultivates. While it's understandable for celebrities to decline autograph requests at times, it's a different story when they resort to insulting fans. One particular incident stands out. A disabled veteran requested Bullock's autograph only to be met with her covering her face and verbally abusing him. 
The aftermath of this unfortunate encounter surely posed quite a challenge for her PR team as they worked to smooth things over with the public. Adding to the complexity of her public perception, her ex-husband Jesse James made claims in an interview that he cheated on Bullock because he felt inferior due to her allegedly controlling behavior. It's important to note that James has his own reputation as a known jerk, especially concerning his infidelity. Thus, we should take his statements with caution. However, when we consider other accounts that align with his narrative and instances of less than ideal behavior attributed to Bullock, his explanation doesn't seem entirely implausible. Number 18. Cameron Diaz Cameron Diaz has garnered a reputation as one of the least approachable celebrities in Hollywood, and it seems there's good reason behind it. Fans who have dared to ask for her autograph have reportedly received more than just a simple no. Diaz is said to not only decline autograph requests, but also lecture fans on why asking for autographs is a foolish endeavor. This stern response, often delivered with a tone that some describe as maternal, leaves little room for interaction and can come across as Raythor off-putting. In addition to her autograph aversion, Diaz's behavior at social gatherings has also raised eyebrows. During a party hosted by Drew Barrymore, witnesses observed Diaz spending the majority of the time chain-smoking and, perhaps more surprisingly, refusing to share cigarettes with fellow guests. While the etiquette of cigarette sharing may vary, ignoring social norms and isolating oneself from others' company is generally considered impolite. While everyone has their own boundaries and preferences, there are certainly more gracious ways to navigate social interactions and decline requests without leaving others feeling rebuffed or alienated. It remains to be seen whether Diaz's behavior will affect her public image in the long run, but for now, it seems her cigarettes may be her closest companions. 19. Chevy Chase It's unfortunate to acknowledge that Chevy Chase's public persona doesn't quite match up with reality. Despite his attempts to portray himself as a lovable and hilarious goofball, numerous reports suggest that he's anything but. In fact, Chase has earned a reputation for being a complete jerk, with even his co-stars from SNL expressing disdain for him due to his rude behavior while hosting the show. Regrettably, Chase's bad behavior and negative reputation have persisted throughout his entire career, leaving a trail of disgruntled colleagues and disappointed fans in his wake. Disturbingly, there have been instances where he made lewd remarks toward female writers, demonstrating a lack of respect for those who contribute to his work behind the scenes. Moreover, Chase's aversion to politeness extends beyond interactions with colleagues to include fans as well. His unwillingness to extend basic courtesy to others has undoubtedly tarnished his image and led to his departure from NBC's hit show, Community, due to similar onset issues. At this point, it seems unlikely that Chase will change his ways despite the consequences of his behavior. His unwillingness to adapt or show remorse for his actions suggests a deep-seated attitude problem that may persist indefinitely. Number 20. Ellen DeGeneres Ellen DeGeneres, often seen as the sweetheart of daytime TV, seems to have a fan in just about everyone, right? Well, not quite. Surprisingly, there's a significant number of Hollywood stars who aren't too fond of Ellen. It turns out behind the scenes, she might not be as warm and fuzzy as her on-screen persona suggests. Reports have surfaced about her treating her staff quite poorly, going as far as critiquing them for writing jokes that she deems unfunny, which, let's face it, is pretty unexpected behavior coming from a comedian. But here's where it gets even juicier. There was a Twitter storm accusing her of being the meanest person alive after she allegedly tried to get a waitress fired simply because the waitress had chipped a nail. It's like a plot twist in the ongoing saga of Hollywood's favorite daytime host, revealing a side of Ellen that fans never expected to see. That wraps up our list of celebrities with surprising behavior behind the scenes. 
Which of these revelations caught you off guard the most? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button to stay tuned for more fascinating updates in the future. If you found this video intriguing, you'll definitely want to check out the one currently playing on your screen. Click on it and I'll see you there for more captivating content.